Hey Salivas, this is Super Zamaga Barbecue. Today, ladies and gentlemen, the one thing I've been asked literally constantly in my comment section, on Twitter, on my streams, when is season seven coming out? Well, today, that question might just be answered for you. Oh, and we're gonna talk about the brand new Battlegrounds content, which is gonna be dropping really soon. I just chuck all of my take a stain bodies and arms and everything into the fire because you'll find out soon enough. I'm just doing all the lower fusions now. So if you see me out doing Titans and stuff, that's the reason why is I'm trying to get all as many of the lower cards as possible. Team events over. So let's go grab ourselves an RKO out of nowhere. It's okay, not today, Randy, but today. But if you've been living under a rock, then you might not have seen that in several videos, there's been reference to some brand new content that is coming out. Yes, it is this, WA2K Battlegrounds. Additional set of content, which I have no idea why this is coming out, but you know what, I'm not gonna say no. Now, if you guys don't know already, there is a John Cena in the game. Well, this is actually Lance Catamaran, Cosplaying as John Cena because everyone knows we can't see him. 2014 jokes for the win. Full set of these cars are coming out, including Samoe Joey. Roman Reigns, a new John Cena. I'm joking, because he's now turned heel and now Roman Reigns is amazing. He'll be joining Stone Cold Steve Austin, Becky Lynch. I can't think of all of them, but I know they've all been revealed. Here is the first look at the individual cards for you which I got from 2K, so thanks to them and Cat Daddy. Let me know what you think about those in the comment section down below. I personally am loving, loving the Stone Cold Steve Austin. Loving it. The Battleground stuff arrives literally tomorrow. So the Taker stuff's gone. There's no more collectibles. Tomorrow, Battleground stuff drops. Is it going to be fusions? Are they going to be pulled off the board? Is it going to be an event thing? I don't know. All I can tell you is as soon as it drops, your boy is going to be streaming on Twitch. So you want to go check him out. But there's another thing that popped up. So I've come down from cafeteria, gone into the admin room, turned to my right. And what do I see? A like button on the floor and you ignoring it. And I'm sorry. That's incredibly sus. I, I, I'm i going to have to vote. Yeah, I'm going to have to green out one. If they did it now, didn't ignore it, then maybe maybe it wouldn't be so sus. Don't want to get ejected. Nope. Oh, okay. They, they've pressed it now. I, I don't think it's... We don't need to do anything. We could just, we could just skip. Yeah, I'll skip. Let's skip. Season 7. Release date, you might see in the game, Team Battleground PvP, the final update in the stores. Now, Money in the Bank update, pretty standard. We all know this is gonna continue until Survivor Series. Everyone knows that. It's been like that since day one. Are we surprised? No. Team Battleground store and the League Point store. So let's go to the rewards. They have updated it with a brand new set of pros, Plus, you got yourself a new set of grab bags as well. Ooh, as if they've got a gronk. If I had more battle points, I'd go for that right now. What other cards are they offering in the mix? Oh, are oh, they offering? No way. They're offering the Vanguard McFoley. I am jelly, but trust me, do not spend it. 96,000 battle points is absolutely ridiculous. But I don't know if you noticed, why have I just clicked off it? The date, 14 days, 20 hours, the same as money in the bank. I can tell you the reason why that is, but before I need to show you in the League Point store, because lo and behold, 14 days and 20 hours. Well, of course it all ends up going towards one date, which I'll talk about in a second. Now, just to clarify, this is not official. I'm going purely by what the, the dates say in game. So don't take this as 100%. But if all the stores are being compressed, being condensed into one, then they won't continue 
after 14 days and 20 hours. So that logically would make you think that the game's just told you it's coming out on the 18th. Now, again, this is purely based on the facts and figures in here, but the entire point of this new store, this new currency, super coins and the super store is to combine leak points, battle points, money in the bank contracts. Why am I doing big fish, little fish, cardboard box? Maybe I did that wrong. I'm not sure. Surely the dates on these marry up with when things are going to change. So going by this, the 18th is it is. Let me know if you think I'm right or wrong in the comment section down below. And whilst you're there, don't forget to hit that big red subscribe button. And the next bit's going to make you feel really bad. For me, the Undertaker fusions. The last couple of days of it were very painful. I came back from not playing it pretty much for the first two days and managed to get myself a really respectable amount of enhancements. And then for the last couple of days, all I got were arms, just arms everywhere. Now for anyone who has already watched the Dead Man quest and pack opening video will know that I already have myself a very dead dead man. And because it's past Halloween now, I'm gonna change this to Bikertaker because it's a really, really cool. Mm -hmm. But I didn't have any of the fusions. I wasn't lucky in the fusions. And I ended up on 49. 49 of the Taker dolls. Very frustrating. Very frustrating. So I'm going to go ahead and claim this Undertaker car. Now, what I will say to people is with Season 7 coming, based on what I've been saying recently, uh, or in, in, this, in the rest of the video, which guys on here wouldn't see do not use tickets do not use league points do not use tbg points even though it looks so enticing second season seven drops you'll regret it okay i promise you and money in the bank don't don't do money in the bank because as good as these images are and sasha's really good really really good don't do it trust me you'll have another opportunity to get them but i need to get myself undertaker it's just a solitary undertaker i'm not going to get the pro which i'm really sad about really sad about how are you ready i'm ready i'm so sad i played all day today I, I literally played all in fact i even got other people to to jump on for me because i was getting no luck i was literally playing pretty much all morning pretty much all afternoon and i still all i got what arms this is the result by the way i was level two this morning of this level two i'm now nearly level five halfway through level four that's the result of what i was trying to do to get the heads and to get the bodies but the bodies did not nope. hit the floor and now i'm stuck this undertake but at least i've got the image and the image is freaking fire that's really what matters isn't it mm. boom Undertaker, dead man i'm slightly disappointed i've not got the pro i'm not going to get the star for it but you know what end of of season 11 away man 11 away 11 away the question is now i don't know what to do with the rest of these do i just open these dead man forever packs because like why not or do i hold them back for the picks is there any images that you need from the pack oh no i don't need any images because i've got each and every single one of these but i do need the pro for this one and if i was to get two of them that'd be pretty cool let's check out the images first or Undertaker. So we've locked it in. Oh, I wonder what it looks like on here. I just got this out of the fusion chamber. I'm doing the old fusions now. Oh, that SmackDown one looks great. SmackDown Taker looks. There's uh there's Chunder Taker. And here is I mean okay. Yeah. Meh okay. meh. So here's right. the actual Undertaker itself. Uh, which I'm sure many of you have seen already. Ooh. Oh, the, the ring domination taker. That's actually a really, really rare card as well. Looks great. Got Legendary Taker, Season 1. That looks great. You got Border Taker. Big Border Taker. Uh, this is the one where he lost, isn't it? Possibly. Maybe not. That that looks great. I'm a big fan of the Super Token. I just wish they didn't have the white outline. PCC Take. Oh, oh, that looks... That's tasty. He's got some good images. That one looks great. A Super Rare Season 2. Is it Super Rare or Ultra Rare? I'm not sure. Masked Undertaker. I mean, it, it's good. We've got the, uh, the limited edition Undertaker, which is the QR code uh, P of PCC ones. So many. Uh, you got the the, the absolutely 100% dead. Like, I don't think there's any coming back. Oh, maybe we might have a winner. 
I think we have a winner, ladies and gents. Although well, this one looks pretty cool. A season two WrestleMania Fusion is amazing on it. Season two WrestleMania Fusion does look good on it. Oh, yeah, I don't know. That's pretty. Iconic. It goes so well. Uh, you gotta, we've got to do this one. The uh, Rob, St I mean, the, in fairness, that's the the clearest I've ever seen the Rob Hamburger one. Because usually it's hidden by something. Uh, this is the the biker taker. I mean, it goes, it goes with the image like really well. You've got the the WrestleMania 36. This card just literally houses. Oh, God, there's so many different choices, but that's one of them. That's got to be one of them just because of the offset of the white. All right, I'm sorry. It's going to be this one. Or has, does it or do we do SmackDown? No, I think I think we're going to have to choose this one. It's just it's too good. It's got the purple around it. It's got the green shining up the 30 years and the dirt as well, which is coming up, which which you know, there's, there's the dirt there. I'm sorry. It's got to be that. Let's see what the other one looks like on here, though. Okay, so that one doesn't really go. <laughs> That one don't really go. We needed like a, when he came back, WrestleMania 36. We need that American badder, badass. It is literally perfect. You couldn't get better. So the reason why the picks aren't a good idea, by the way, that isn't gents, once I start a new King of the Ring, because the collectibles, if I go along to here and I claim it, not only does it take me straight to the draft board, if you go beyond 45 picks, it actually stops you. So I would love to save these up for whatever the next event's going to be. And I'm pretty sure we know what the next event's going to be, given the, the, the reveals with um, Up, Up, Down, Down the other week. Mm -hmm. But you can't physically save those up. So it's kind of disappointing. I like, literally have no, no use for them. And they're not going to bring them back. So that, that's it. That's the end of the Taker event. So we've got a bunch of these. Hopefully we can get this image proed. Otherwise, it's kind of... It's a lot of legacy stuff. Dead Man Forever packs. Let's go! Loving the American Badass. We've got two more packs to go. Dead Man Forever, number one. Number two. We're not going to get two of them. Which is booty! I didn't even get one of them. I remember that one, though. I remember that that uh, that card. One of my most viewed Money in the Bank videos. Have a look at that. If you guys haven't seen it yet, let's go to rewards. LP store. Let's go down to card backs. Yowie wowie indeed. I like it. If it was one half uh, the Fiend, one half Bray on the same card, I would like it. But it's kind of like two thirds of both. So far away, we wait for the day.